John there is Scott here from PC Solutions here today to talk about the Gigabyte X79 Dash UD3 motherboard. Now, this is an Intel Socket 2011 motherboard. This is your high end i7 Nvidia series. First thing that I notice when using this motherboard is a nice, sleek, clean look that it's got. Even right down to the heat sinks here, just looking very, very nice, clean and tidy. Uh, it's just a generally nice looking board, certainly wouldn't be embarrassed to have a window on the side of my case with this in it. Next feature that is really nice with this board. Now the next thing that I did notice in the box which was really nice and is especially great for gamers who want to have multiple GPU setups is all the SLI and CrossFi configuration. We've got four way, three way, two way SLI, plus we've got CrossFi cables there, nice addition to have in the box. Now as you can see the board has four DIMM sockets, uh, this gives you the maximum 32 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM with all your flavors of memory speed supported by this board. Now what I do like is that Gigabyte have done little, little things like side mounted SATA connectors that I would expect on a board uh, on this end of the scale, it just makes it very nice for cable management. Another nice thing about this board is the clamp for the cooling options that you can have. Now we've obviously got the Intel stock cooler in the moment, if you are going to go for a water cooling setup it's certainly sturdy enough to take the, the water blocks that you're going to be using. The other thing as well is just remember to have some air cooling around the VRMs if you are going to do that, especially if you are going to block. All in all, this is a pretty nice piece of kit. If I was going to be going for a Socket 2011 system, this would be the board that I'd be recommending. And the fact it comes with a five-year uh, warranty, which is really nice. Gigabyte has certainly not taken any shortcuts with the components. It use very high-end components in the board certainly something that will have to live up to the five year warranty so i'm very very happy with this and just with all the tests that we've done on it is a very stable piece of kit uh, i'm 